Hey guys, welcome back to week three of the Fun in the Sun Doodle Bug Challenge. Let's see what we want to use today. Pineapple is kind of enticing. Actually, you know that RV would be kind of cool to work with. Would RVs and pineapples go together? <laughs> Hmm. So I'm kind of thinking like I have Heck. I have this cactus left which would go well with this which is a very comforting thought to me because brown and green are my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like, oh yeah, go the safe route. But then I'm like, well, you know, also this, the, um, bug RV, what is that called? Caravan. My gosh. <laughs> um, would go well with this blue and brown combo as well. Or even the pineapples would be good with the you know what I think I'm gonna do this combo and save the caravan and the cactus which I know seems kind of weird but in a way it kind of works <laughs> at least in my brain it kind of is working out all right so we can have some yellow um, actually yeah yellow is Let's do some cream. Actually, meh. Meh. Yeah, let's do cream as well as the yellow. Whoa, hello. Stick that bag in there. And let's make our card bases. And I've got a lot of stuff to work on because I still have a bunch of embellishments left. So I need to kick my gear into using some of those embellishments. Let me just fold my card bases here. That's enough card bases. If not, I can make some more. Won't be too hard. Alright, so let's see what we want to do here. I'm thinking. Well, actually, let's take a look at our four our squares here. And kind of decide. Well, cactus, I should save for the actual cactus. You know, that one would be kind of cool. You know, Sweet Life I can use with the pineapple. Alright, so let's go ahead and do those two. And then... We've got a bunch of those strips and a bunch of the banners. So let's go ahead and just do our normal... Oh, actually, that would be kind of cool on this background. So I need five and a quarter. By four. With this wood grain pattern, it doesn't really matter too much what direction I cut it. And then I'm going to need a four 
by five and a quarter. I'm doing this so I have a little bit of extra just random pieces because <laughs> I'm going to use that for my bait or the the square card. Let's go ahead and cut that. And we'll see what to do with that later. So then I need a five and a quarter of this, the pineapple paper, and a four. Trim that section off. Save that for later. Five and a quarter. Five and a quarter. And I can see that extra piece there. And then also, oops, four. Knows. All right, let's start with those square cards. I just I love those square cards or square pieces. How that card turned out last week. We are on week three. I don't, I don't even remember if I said that. Did I accidentally say week two? Week two. <laughs> I have a feeling I might have. All right. Actually, I want to do that. Bright yellow. Let's do that one with. Oh, yeah. Our other pieces here. That's okay. I'm okay with that. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen. It's okay. They look fine like that. And I cut off the excess here. And let's just use that too. I mean, it kind of looks weird, but oh, actually, I'll use the tiki on the back. That won't look as weird. Makes me want to go to the beach. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have picked this paper bag. Something needs to go on the corner there. Meh. I kind of like it as is, though. Okay. So let's go ahead and do our pineapples here. I 
need two pieces. I'm actually going to do two kind of the same card um, with the pineapple and with the wood grain. That pineapple is so cool. Okay. So I'm going to take this extra pieces here. Cut them down to about three inches. Or actually four inches. So that's going to be Four of those. Did I say four inches? Yeah. Oh. There. <laughs> dirt, dirt. One, two, three, four. Not only with those. Cut these in half. At one and a half seems about All right. It's a little off, but that's okay. I'm not going to worry too much about it. I'm going to turn them into banners. So I'm going to do a color of each, one side of the paper, and then flip it. That's fine. This one's fine. And then flip this one. And flip this one as well. I want no <laughs> trying to figure out what the heck I'm doing here. will be saved for the next one. The other ones that I'm making. Whoa.
my banner pieces down. And then let's get some sentiments in here. Big adventure and a beach bum. <laughs> other set of those but with the wood grain Banner pieces over here. I wish I had more yellow. That's okay. Together forever. And breathtaking. <laughs> Sometimes watermelons can be, or watermelons. Sometimes pineapples can be breathtaking because they're so sour. Sometimes it's just like. Ugh. <laughs> okay. Let's do. One of those and one of these. Might need to make more card bases. leftover pieces that I had from cutting out those papers. Let's take this green scallop and put it underneath. the wrong one. <laughs> Glad I caught myself there. Oh, I put it way too high. That's okay. I think it'll still look okay. No, come off. I 
got some green scallop left there. Let's get sentiment. There's a thinking of you. Ooh, an aloha. That would be kind of cool. I gather up all my pieces here a bit more organized. Instead of having a lot of chaos. Goodness gracious. There are definitely some things that I haven't really used much of, like these long sentiments. There's only so many sentiments you can use. Enjoy the ride. Oh, that would be good for the caravan. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> Make me happy. That would be good on that. Good day, sunshine. I like the aloha on that one. And then let's use the you make me happy. I can pick it up. Very cool. Alright, so I need to use some of these really big sentiments up, so I might just do a normal... Oh, actually I need to make more card bases before I do anything else. Let's do some more of that cream. I'm open. <laughs> All right, so let's do these normal so that I can use up those sentiments. So I have a bunch of them. I've got a bunch of them that are like really long, so I need to do them in this long style card. Oh, I actually made the perfect amount of card bases. So I'll have an extra yellow one for next time, but that's okay. That's not too much of a problem. Okay. I'm also going to use those borders as well. Let's just go ahead and stick that down.
Let's use. You make me smile. Cute and simple. All right. Now let's grab this. That'll look good on the pineapple. Cards. smidge left of that. I don't know if I'll be able to use that or not. But. Um, let's do Good Day Sunshine. And Take the Long Way Home. Eh. Let's do Don't Worry, Be Happy. That works. Ooh, this one's longer than... That one actually would have been good with the cactus on it. Mm. Dang. That's okay. So one last one here. I guess just use this blue polka dot. Rick rack, kind of. Do, 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 do. The happy birthday look weird. Kind of. But I kind of like it as well. <laughs> Looks weird, but I like it. Smidge of that left too. I think that's all the papers from that time. Yeah. All right. So that's it for week three. We have week four left, and then we are done. So we only have two papers left, plus some more. And you know, there is a lot of stuff left. <laughs> I might just have to make like a random, a few random cards without like any paper. <laughs> All right, so there is that card, and that one, and that one. So we, I really tried to use up our sentiments this time, and I still have a ton. But I really love how these turned out. I love the pineapple and brown together. Alright guys, 
that is it for week three. Don't forget to tune back in next Monday so that you can see the last bit of um, the last cards made with this kit. We have, you know, a, a nice supply of things left. Oh, excuse me. So I think we can make quite a few cards next time. All right. Don't forget to hit that like button and come back next week. I hope you're having a crazy day, not too crazy, good crazy, not bad crazy, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!